Hi everyone, in this video, I'm just going to explain about the drag and drop the files uh, in your project. So uh, you can easily drag and drop the files. For example, the thing, this is the scenario, like this is the sample text file, right? So I'm just going to click and drag to this documents. I'm just going to put into the documents folder. So it's moved one item to documents. So what I'm doing is now I'm just going to revert it back move to the same folder so let's start I mean we'll go and write the scripts I'm just going to put the sample file text file in, into documents anything you can move it right okay then open your Eclipse and here I have find the scripts here just I am logging in in I mean getting logging in and then I'm going to get the element here web element element from from right to this is the file right sample file so here I'm just going to use this text I'm going to search with this text driver dot find element by X path this is the syntax tar it will search all the root file child and grandchild everything it will be I mean it will check with the star option so I'm gonna uh, expect this text sample file here the sample file so and also I'm going to this is the documents folder I'm going to move right so I just put the two elements in the element variable just I did it first then actions actions it's an object it's a method it's I'm going to do it now uh, create creating variable builder and another thing is action drag and drop I am just going to put this drag and drop option builder dot click and hold I am just going to click and hold this the sample file then I am going to move the element element from move to element from and gonna release this to this documents so I am just clicking and holding and moving to this documents we should once we have created the builder variable we need to build it I mean the complete actions once we build it then we are going to perform it with this action variable so finally actions I mean uh, once it's built we need to perform it right so also don't forget this here in the syntax it should not end with semicolon it should not end with semicolon so the action items all or without semicolon at the end of this so once I have done this, just going to perform and watch this now, how it's going to work. It's opening. I mean, getting login in. And then I'm holding the sample file now. See, it's moved more than one item to documents. So if you click this documents, you can see this file inside. That's it. This is the best way to explain about this drag and drop options. You can use this in various scenarios of your test. That's it. Thank you so much for watching my video. Please provide your comments and feedbacks on my video forms. Thank you.